journal entry with only one account being debited and only one account being credited. And there are three scenarios. The first one is to transfer money between income and expense accounts. The other is to transfer money from an asset, liability or equity account to an income or expense account. And you can also use journal entry as a traditional system of accounting that enters debits and credits in a general journal or ledger. To create a journal entry, select Add. We select the journal date and journal number at the top. First, I plan to choose an expense account and I'd like to say I got 500 so I'm going to select reconciliation discrepancies account on the first line and then in the debit column I'm going to enter 500 that and I'm going to put a description like monthly depreciation for why you're entering the journal entry and then I'm going to put property, plant and equipment account on the second line and it's going to be a credit and enter the same amount in the credit column and I am bring down the same description as the previous one. Enter description. When you're done, select save. Journal entry is recorded and displayed in the journal entry management screen. This journal entry also shows up in reports. I will choose a representative report that is journal report. I will filter the report by the date of the journal entry and as you can see, the journal entry I just created is showing in this report. The journal entry also shows up in the register screens of the related accounts and uses it for reconciliation later. As you can see, the journal entry is displayed in the register page of property, plant and equipment account. And this journal entry also shows up in the register page of the reconciliation discrepancies account. We scroll down and find the line with a credit of 500.